What is going on, everybody? Today, we're gonna work on a bus. Let's check it out. I was going to do the roof and paint it. That's gotta change because it looks like garbage outside. It is about to storm. So, with, with that being said, come on boy, everyone meet Dexter. With that being said, this is the bus right there. All of these screws, hundreds of them, are coming off all the way around. We're gonna do all the way there and all the way here. forward on this until the owner calls me back. So while I'm waiting for him to call me back, there's all these little holes in the floor from where the seats were. So I'm gonna fill that with this stuff. Had a big drop. Hi. It's a lot. We got to paint. A lot. We got to cook. Not very stable there. Not very stable on the sides. Very stable in the middle. All right. Guess it's time to go to work. doing now is we're sanding the roof trying to get all those years of gook and nastiness off so the new paint would stick nicely to this we're trying to clean these edges right here because we're gonna recalk all these seams and then paint over that and make sure that there will be no leaking so if you are doing a paint job to your roof I highly suggest checking the caulking around your escape hatch because 90% of the time it will just peel right off and that's why we want to check up here before we paint make sure we put new caulking down so this doesn't happen for another couple years <laughs> Got done setting the roof to work on the side. It's almost done. Uh, now we're going to get to caulking all these seams and making sure that his roof never leaks. is going on everybody it is day four or five of the build I don't really remember but the last couple days have been really really terrible weather out so now it's Saturday beautiful weather and right now what I'm doing is taking off the emergency exit BS that's on here so when we put the there goes my razor 
But anyway, when we put the coating on, you won't be able to see this. I'm going to sand this down. And we are going to finish the paint job today. I promise. So I'll show you how we do that. It's been 15 minutes. That's how far I got. But on a side note, my wife showed up with the puppers. And coffee. And she brought me coffee. They're going to knock over. They're going to knock over. My wife told me not to put the coffee on the top stair because it's going to spill. And I said, no, it's not. Two minutes later. Rest in peace. You're not doing too hot. I'd say the devil's winning. <laughs> So, we're back. A lot easier this way, guys. One side down, one more to go. All right, so I laid out some of the stuff that I used so far. So for the caulking on the roof, I use this stuff. Um, I'm about to paint the roof with this. It's um, a coating that does stuff, good stuff. That's why we got it. And now we're gonna go up and I'm gonna start with the sides all the way around and then roll on the top. So let's see how that goes. supposed to be finger painting babe yeah well I might as well take the opportunity while I have it it's ready okay. <laughs> well this is the first coat of the UV reflecting paint that we put on so this is what it looked like before and this is just with one coat and if you look right down there you can already see the huge difference so what are we doing baby second coat second coat painting Painting. Call me Michelangelo. Call her Michelangelo. What time is it? So, to do all of that took us three hours to take off emergency exit decals and paint two coats on this roof so i left a little section so you can see what one coat looks like obviously right there barely even covers the first layer and then the rest of the bus that's the with two coats so we used about babe how many cans we use one and a half a can and a quarter we're a little tired so we're happy with this and hopefully he's happy with the progress and how i got paint all over my hand. Maybe he'll be happy about that too. <laughs> 